quickly take this question. Mm. Three four ohm resistors connected in parallel have a potential difference of 16 volts applied across them. What is the total current in the circuit? So we are, as usual, we're going to first sketch, sketch our circuit from the description there. So there, here the first, they said three resistors. That means we have R1, R2, and R3. And all of them are four ohms. Four ohms. Mm -hmm. We. Sorry. All of them are four ohms. And resistor number three, four ohms. So, and potential difference as the voltage is what? 16 volts. What is the total current drawn? So, I'm going to sketch it so that you have a better understanding. So these three parallel resistors, this is what it's going to be. One, two, three. I mean, that's a one, two, three. That's the first resistor. This is the second resistor. And this is the third resistor. Connected in parallel. All of them have the same resistance, 4 ohms, 4 ohms, 4 ohms. So, and then there is a, the potential difference across them is um, 16 volt. Here is 16 volt. So now we have to calculate the total current. The total current means the current drawn from the cell, I. The current that will be drawn from the cell. Remember, in each of these resistors, the current in each of them, you know, this total current here will come and split itself into I1, I2, I3, depending on the size of the resistance. But since all of them are the same resistor, that is, since all the resistance are the same, it will be the same. The current that will flow through each will be the same, but it won't be uh, the same as the total current here. Hmm? So how do we get this total current? From Ohm's law, V equals to what? I, R. Where I here represents the total current and R here represents what? Equivalent resistance. Already the V here represents the total voltage, which is here 16. So that I will be what? V divided by equivalent resistance. So the challenge here is to find the equivalent resistance. So since there are three resistors in parallel, that will be one over R equivalent. Will be what one over R one plus one over R two plus one over R three. So that will be one over four plus another one over four plus another one over four, which is the same thing as one over four times three. That's one over four in three places hmm? to give us what three over four. So we now have 1 over R equivalent to be what? 3 over 4. Then if you take the reciprocal of both sides, or you make R equivalent the subject of the formula, you end up having that R equivalent to be what? 4 over 3 ohms. That's 1 point something. So the equivalent resistance is 4 over 3 ohms, or 1 point something ohms. But it's not equivalent resistance we are asked to find. We have to find current. So current now will be 12. That's V over equivalent resistance. That will be 12 divided by what? 4 over 3. Which is the same thing as 12 times 3 divided by 4. 4 will cancel itself 1. Cancel 12. 3 times. Cancel 12. 3. 3 times. Did I say, sorry, this wasn't supposed to be 12. This, our V is 16. Sorry, our V is 16. Hmm? So this here is 16. Sorry for that mistake. Okay, 
So four will cancel is a one cancel sixteen four times. Four times three twelve. That will be twelve ampere. Option B. Thank you.